You had the measles? I had the measles. I wasn't, I wasn't immune. I took the shots, but I was not immune. I went to a doctor's office. I'm not going to say the name of the doctor because I don't want to put it out in public. It wasn't Monsi. I was the, one of the, fir the, the first, probably the 13th person to have the measles. What were the symptoms like? Can you explain the to my viewers? Was it was Friday night. I started having fever. I, was, I wasn't well. Sunday night, I woke up and I was schwitzing. I was ter terrible fever, like 104, 105. Got up in the morning, came into work. It was all day work. work, work I, I'm all day between people. All right. And at night, I just said, I can't take it anymore. I came home, I looked myself in the mirror, and I said, that's measles. I went into the hospital. Or you had blotches all I over? I was reason? all over my face. My, my, my stomach, my back, all over. So first it started with the fever, fever. and then how many hours after did the, the, the redness and the blotches come? I would say come? two days afterwards. Two days after the fever, that's yes. when it, the, the signs were clearly there? Yes. Okay, and then what did you do? I ju they took me into the hospital, they, they isolated me, and they clarified that it's measles. My kids did not walk out for the whole week. Not my wife, not my kids, I have four kids. We're all at home, no school, just because the father punished them. Just because another person came into the doctor and I was at the same time by the doctor and I and I caught the measles. Did anyone else that was near you over those few weeks catch it? I have no idea. I have tons of people around me and I notified them all. Actually, yes, now that you're asking me, I do remind myself. I have that person that works with me a lot. All of his kids got it. Wow. And they were all immunized. Uh -huh. and do you know uh, the ages? Like when were they immunized? Uh, I wouldn't know the age. Well, were they when you say immunized? They were immunized before they got the measles, or immunized after? Before they got the measles, before. but they didn't take the boosters yet. It wasn't strong enough. They were too young, probably, to get the booster. That's oh, so they were young, their kids? They were young kids. Yeah. Okay, the so ages, I don't know they for they sure did not get that second shot? The second shot, they, wouldn't, they weren't able to get it. Oh, they were that young. Oh, okay. You know, what's your feeling of how the media is really reporting, you know, the, the story? I'll, the media, I'm not going to comment how the media reports it because I don't think even the way they do it, the way they say it's only between, between the community, it's probably, it's probably out there much more than in our community. But I would say, people in our community, you should take the shot. It is important. And of course, people walking around saying that they do measles parties, that what, that's what the media is all about. The media loves that. So they come, they, come, they come around and we get punished for it. Do you know anyone that actually went to a measles party? You can... Uh, Personally, I don't know, but people went on TV and they said that they, they do make measles parties, and I think it's a shame. Uh, what, what was it when you first heard that? Did you even hear of such a thing, a measles party? What I, I, what I thought the first thing that when I heard the measles party, that that penalty for such a person. Honestly, honestly, I was I I, I felt that I was like I was dying that week, and it's it, and it was not. I'm a I'm a young person. I'm in my thirties. I'm a young person, and I'm a healthy person. Just, I wasn't immune, even though I took the shot, but I shouldn't be, if you, if you want to get the measles, lock yourself into your house. Don't make a measles party. Uh, but do you find it ironic that the media is not covering that a lot of people getting the measles were immunized? You even said in your case you were immunized, your friends were immunized, yet they got it anyway. And that is not being reported that's not by the media. Report. That's why I'm saying, I'm not, I'm not gonna, I don't want to comment about the media, they're misrepresenting some parts. Because some people did immunize, some people did not immunize, and they didn't get it. But if, I would say people should immunize, definitely okay. immunize. Now, now that you had it, did the doctors tell you you're immune for life because you got the measles? The doctor said that I am immune for life, but my immune system is so weak, I caught shingles over the past five seconds. I was so weak, and I'm, when I say I had the measles, I had the measles in October. My immune system is still that weak that I got shingles. Yeah. You're immune? No, no. You're back But I'm, I'm weak. No, I'm definitely you're weak. weaker. You're more I, tired? Like I'm you're more tired. I'm, I'm a, I usually sleep five hours a night. I don't eat more than five hours. Right now, I would say I need another two, three hours a night at least to get to myself. Not, not even to... to now, is that normal or that's, that's not, not normal? normal. The that's doctors normal. told you that's not that's normal? That's not normal, no. My immune system is not back to normal. It's going to take a while. Do you know how long or what did the doctor say? It's, I'm slowly getting back to myself. 
Right? It takes time. There's no there's no time limit for it. Okay. Thank you.